Hi, welcome back to Shotoku Tech. It's been a while since I've worked with the Helltech V3 in Arduino IDE, uh, but I got this comment on this video asking me about using the KY040 encoder with the Helltech V3, and I thought that this is a great opportunity to get back to Arduino IDE working on the Helltech Wi-Fi LoRa 32 V3. So let's check it out. Yeah, this is the KY040 encoder. Look for the link down below in the description for the product page. Okay, so I wanted to figure out what library to use in Arduino IDE. So we're searching for encoder and library manager. Okay, I'm going to click on more info. Yeah, I want it to be a GitHub-based library. So I think I'm going to pass on this. Plus, this is just about Teensy and Arduino. Doesn't, doesn't mention ESP32 necessarily. This looks like it's going to be like very specific to that brand of hardware, and that's what it seems to be. Yeah, absolute contacting encoder. That, I, that doesn't sound like what I'm looking for. This looks like another brand-specific or hardware-specific item. Yeah, same for that. AS5200L magnetic. Okay, Excel motor is pairing an encoder with a stepper motor. Ace button, yeah, you want to handle the button bounce, but that's not going to be enough. AI ESP32 rotary encoder. That sounds like exactly what we need. Let's check out the README. Yeah, no mention of a specific brand or make of hardware. It just says rotary encoder with an ESP32. That sounds pretty positive. I'm thinking it's going to work with that KY040. So you can see I've got that installed. Let's take a look where the example sketches are. I'm going to scroll all the way down to the bottom. Yeah, AI ESP32 rotary encoder. He's got a lot of example sketches. I'm just going to go with the Rotary Encoder Basics. You know, leave a comment down below if you see a different example sketch in that library that you want me to demonstrate. Always happy to respond to comments when they're, uh, when they're useful for me. You can see the include files are very simple. The, the trickiest part is just making sure you understand DT pin is pin B and the clock pin is pin A. Because when you get down here, it refers to pin A and pin B, not clock and DT. So you can see I've already got the pins in there. Yeah, remember the Helltech Wi-Fi 32 V3 has four open pins that you can use for anything. That's 45, 46, 47, and 48. So I'm hooking clock to pin 46. We'll hook... DT or pin B to 45. Now let's get the blue wire here. And we're going to hook the switch all the way on the other side to pin 47. There we go. Let's see. Then we're going to hook, yeah, 3.3 volts to the plus on the encoder and then of course ground goes to ground I haven't really worked on using the other pins I've been sticking with the open pins 45 46 47 and 48 okay so I hear I've hooked up to com 4 let's open the serial monitor yeah I've already compiled and uploaded the sketch there wasn't any tricks to it other than setting those pin numbers in the code there, I push the button, you see, button pressed, button pressed. And this is a cool library because if you spin it slowly, it'll increment by one. But if you spin it really fast, it'll skip a whole bunch of numbers. <laughs> yeah. So I guess that's where the AI part comes in. Yeah, you can see just turning it gently, 99, 98, 97, 96, 95, and then spin that thing rapidly and it'll skip all the way down to zero pretty rapidly. And the same is true for going up as well. So I'm also excited on working with this encoder in Meshtastic on the Helltech V3 because it would be interesting for the canned messages function uses an encoder. Now I'm just playing around now spinning it. 
All right, yeah, back to zero. Okay, that was fun. So look for the link down below for the library. Like I say, if you see any of the example sketches you'd like to check out, leave a comment. I think it's an interesting library. He has a lot of interesting information in this article. Uh, yeah, there's the product page. Look for the link down below. Give this video a like, leave a comment down below, and before you go watch more of my Helltech Wi-Fi LoRa 32 videos, please click on subscribe. Thank you very much.